the Rich Coats Maiden is next. And another small field. About six this time, I think. Two and a half miles again. Hurdles this time. Um, big time at the top four. Leon Van Rensburg, Wayfinder, Joshua Sutherland, Circular Bridge, Martin Lidham, Gallant Gina, Paul Rhodes, Octopussy, Stu Gray, and Southern Hero for Craig Beckwith. So just six. To face the starter. And away they are two greys in this one. I was saying yesterday we won't get too many greys so far this season. But we've got two in this one. And Southern Hero is going to be the first to show. As they make their way to the first of ten flights. They're pretty tightly packed as they make their way to the first. Nothing seems all that keen to be the leader. Southern Hero is currently the leader. Takes the first nicely, they're all over it okay. Whether it's leading because he wants to or it's there on sufferance, I'm not overly sure. But the jockey seems to have accepted his fate, but he's going to be the leader. And drives himself into the second and jumped that one really well, got away from it nicely and leads by a good two and a half to three now from Big Time, who's hard held in second. The first of the greys closest to us is Octopus, he was doing great. Right over on the far side, Wayfinder in the black and red hoops for Joshua Sullivan as they take number three in Circular Bridge and Gallant Gina. Another one of those new sets of colours of Paul Rose who's keeping us on our toes this season. A different set of silks with every race just about. But it's Southern Hero in the lead in the big time second and Octopussy third. Then Wayfinder is fourth and Circular Bridge is fifth and Gallant Gina is the back marker. But after not appearing to be all that keen to lead, Southern Hero is taken to the task quite nicely and he's stepping out well in the lead and jumped that one really nicely and took another length or two out of the field with a good quick jump. Big time is six lengths back in second. And Octopussy is third and Wayfinder is fourth. And Circular Bridge in a yellow cap is fifth. And he's second of the Greys, Gallant Gina just poking her head in the shot as they take flight number five. That's the midway point in the jumping. Southern Hero, the lead is now drastically reduced as Big Time looms on the outside and comes right up to within a length or so. The rest of the field are virtually in a line as they take the six, but again Southern Hero dropped it really well and opened up by another length. Big Time in second, Octopussy third, Gallant Gina is now moved along the outside of Circular Bridge to take a share of fourth. And Wayfinder now just the back marker. Southern Hero two lengths to the good. Big time in second. Five length gap then back to the pair of greys, Octopussy and Gallant Gina. Circular Bridge being pushed along in between those two and Wayfinder just binding its time on the inside. Jockey doesn't appear to be too concerned about that one's position at the moment. There's still a mile to go. And Southern Hero races downhill with a lead of two lengths. Big time in second. Get back to Gallant Gina. Circular Bridge moves around the outside. Wayfair, as the Wayfinder has now gone around the outside as well of the other grey octopus who's now on the inside. They've just jumped the seventh. They've got three more to take then now. And Southern Hero is still in the lead. Three clear of big time in second. We chase him back, getting a little bit closer. Wayfinder has now taken control of that group and is moving through into third. But it's Southern Hero is still the leader. Southern Hero from Big Time Wayfinder is getting considerably closer. Then comes Gallant Gina, Octopussy and Circular Bridge struggling a little bit out the back. But it's Southern Hero who's the leader by two lengths as they come down to the third last flight. With Big Time in second, Wayfinder in third, Gallant Gina now coming up to join them to make a lead in four. As they come down towards this third last, they've still got three furlongs and three flights to go. And Southern Hero has been in the lead all the way, still leads by two. Gallant Gina they now throw down a big challenge, jump that one on the outside in second. Big Time still hasn't made a move on that one yet. Wayfinder is still making ground. Circular Bridge is trying to run on, but too much to do. It's Southern Hero in the lead, two more flights to take. Coming down towards the second last, and Southern Hero was slow over that one, and now Big Time 
and Gallant Gina come to challenge. Big time pokes his head in front. Gallant Gina closest to us, trying to fight back his southern hero. Wayfinder's trying to get between them, but it's big time in the lead into the final furlong, down to the final flight. Over it they go, and big time got over it well. And big time got away from it well, and big time's in the lead. Wayfinder is trying to close, so to his Gallant Gina. Big time's in front, needs the line to come. Wayfinder's getting closer, but not close enough. And big time took it. Wayfinder was second. But he's short running, definitely favoured big time with that running in a minute, a little bit longer. I don't think he'd have held on because the Wayfinder and Gallant Gina were closing. And it's big time the winner for Leon Van Rensburg. Wayfinder for Joshua Sutherland was second. Gallant Gina for Paul Rhodes was third. Southern Hero for Craig Beckwith was fourth. And Circular Bridge was fifth.